Hi, I'm Mr. Sam, the allotment man, and that's my dad. We're not dead, we just <laughs> couldn't be bothered. We're going to have a look around Dad's allotment to see what's growing, aren't we? Allotment, yes. Yes, right. yeah. well, back garden allotment. Yeah. Right, here we go. All right then, so uh, first off, we're in the greenhouse. So uh, what's growing in the greenhouse, Dad? Well, it's mostly brown house at the moment. Brown house, right. The cucumbers, these are the ones that are growing side and they're looking a bit sad because they're right at the end of their uh, period. I've, I've had about 20 of it, I suppose. 20? I'll bring that one into view. Look at that. These are the spiky sort. You just spiky sort, you just rub them off. off. Yeah, and they have rather a tough um, skin, but... Inside, that'd be absolutely gorgeous. Oh, that's lovely. So there we go. So we've been growing them. What else have we got going on in here then, Dad? Uh, oh, this is the onions, which were outside. And I've, the onions? Um, pulled them out about three weeks ago. And they're, they're just dry now, they? Yeah, they're sort of dry. And this is where you keep, you, you store onions in light and dry. Light okay. and dry. Okay. Um, not like I did the other year in dark. Dark and moist. And they all went like that. Moist. That's dry. And that's the shallots. And e e echelon. Echelon? Is that what they are? They're not. They're I don't know. Long. I believe you. I that's don't know. That's all long ones. They're really okay, tasty. Then. Lovely. Okay. And you got tomatoes? Yes. Various ones. Um, these ones are just ordinary types. And then there's these ones. Long types? Yeah. They're sort of Italian ones, but they're... They take ages to get. I don't think they really like our climate. It's not right. No, but oh, well. it's worth a go, isn't it? All right then. And so, plums, um, plum ones. Plum yeah. ones. There you go. So there's the greenhouse. Let's go and have a look outside. Yeah. Oh, I was going to say there isn't much. Wait, you're still going? Are oh. you? What? Yeah. There's not enough. You, there's leaves. You take when you get to this stage, you take the leaves off. Right. And then they ripen quicker. Oh, okay. Because they, they they're stressed out, so they go. Oh dear, we got to get ripe, and then we provide seed for the next generation. All right. Okay. Right. Lovely. There we go. All right. Lem oh, 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 hello. We have got something else as well. What's this? Lemon, Peppers. Lemon trees. Lemon trees. Have you 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 have you ever actually got a lemon off any of your lemon trees? Not yet. No. How many years have you been growing them? About five. Okay. Or six. Near the supermarket. I've got some. At the, yes, dear. Uh, yeah. Okay. Right. We're going outside. Here we go. Right. Yeah. Right, now we're on the phone, so we'll move around. We're outside. Uh, Dad, what have we got growing here? Right, they're, they're potatoes planted recently. Right. Uh, and it's late in the year, it's July now. No, it isn't, it's August, isn't it? No, it's August. It's even later. Very late. Uh, but they're supposed to be late, late uh, maturing, so we can have those new potatoes for Christmas. Oh, new potatoes for Christmas, very nice. I don't know why, but there you go. I don't know, but there you go. And what have, what have we got here? And in here, this is my experiment. Right, what are we experimenting with? Spring onion. Right. Okay, these spring onions. You know when you buy them from the shop? Yeah. Um, they're about so big. And you chop the end off because you don't want the, the root. Yeah. And you throw it away. You throw it away. But you don't. You put them in the ground. Right. Like that. Hopefully we're getting this because I can't see what we're videoing. All right, okay. Yeah. But you just pop them in, so they just a bit like you do leeks, you know, you just pop them in a hole. Yeah. Make sure they're kept damp, and then they grow. And the, these are from... The same thing. From yeah. the supermarket, they're just the ends cut off and then put back yeah. in. And when they grow, um, if, you got, if you're lucky, you get two, or even three there. Ooh. From one that you put in. And then you pull those out, chop the ends off. Yeah. And plant those. At the other, and keep on going. You need never buy a spring onion again. All right, but you just have to wait for in the middle. Obviously, yeah. when you have. They no. don't take long. Well, there you go. Oh, we also got something else here. We've got a, a netting. What's this? This is a. It's the last of the cauliflower. Cauliflower. How? As opposed to Mohicans. Okay. Last of the Mohicans. It's a classic. Classic novel. film. Novel. F film. It's a novel. Oh, they made a book out of it. There we go, very good, okay. And also over there we've got carrots. There, there were about half oh, a dozen. Oh, we're still on the cauliflower. I just had a bit of land I wasn't using, a bit of land. A bit of land. And so I, I bought some plants, not seeds, just the plants from a local 
Oh, all right, yeah. Oh, then they all came up and they were all really good. And this is the last one. Very nice. And there you go. And the carrots over here. Yeah. Well, they're just carrots. Did you do anything special with it? Did you do the planting of the carrots in the in the ground? You put them straight in the ground. Seeds. Yes, but did you put them in the? No, I didn't. You just straight in the ground. Yes. Ooh, very good. I'll tell you why. Because. Why? Um, I had onions in there. Yeah. And I was thinking, what what can you plant? After onions, you see, because you need to do the you need to rotation do a forward roll. Yeah. So what I did, I looked it up. All right. And it says one of the best things you can do is carrots because the onions leave an, a smell in the ground. Residue. 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 Nasty. Mm. So yeah. that which helps keep the um, carrot fly away. Oh, and it has. Well, yes, and this. And the carrot electrified fly fence. electrified fence was yeah. very good. But they, they, I see that these have been in about a month. Yeah. So they should, they're all what they call autumn king ones, so they should be ready about October, November. Oh, that'd be good. Yes. For Christmas. For Christmas. There you go. Uh, raspberries over there. Yes. Well, they're just right. Do we have to talk about them? Well, they're just ripening. They're the last. Just ripening um, now. Uh, autumn ones. Lovely. So, there you go. So that's raspberries. We've got runner beans over here. Yeah. Any particular sort of runner bean? Yeah, very pro prolific, called cobra. Cobra? And they are a run, um, what do you call it, climbing French bean. Lovely. There you um, go. And they're, again, they're coming in sort of to the end. Okay. Uh, but they grow, you get sort of big chubby ones, they grow and grow and grow. That's probably over over the top that one but as you <laughs> see it's not but well, we've had 20 or 30 pounds of them oh that's all right in money no oh in weight yeah all oh, right okay and i've found a way of freezing them i steam them steam yeah you blanch them blanch them blanch them they don't go white though no and then uh, vacuum pack yeah and freeze them yeah so you kill any bugs or anything in it yeah and, and then freeze it. You steam for about five minutes. There you go. And what we've got over here. Now, are these, the first time I've done, co um, not courgettes, um, co cucumbers. Cucumbers out. outside. And they're really good. We've had them. Um, oh, I don't know. Oh, hello. Uh, there's one. There's one. There's, there's a couple on there I can see. Yeah. And there's another one. Look, see. There you go. And they grow a bit slower because they're a bit outside. But they've been. Slow and steady. There's more coming. That's good. You've got a good sunny spot here. Yeah. So there you go. So there you are. And so... Oh, yeah. the other thing I do is, on the bit of ground that you walk on and that... Right, yeah. Uh, I've been mowing... When I mow the lawn, I put it on here. Oh, yeah. For two reasons. Yeah. One, it sort of goes in. Yeah. Later on, I'll dig it in. Yeah. And the other one is, you don't get mud on your shoes and the maid doesn't complain. Excellent. How is the maid? She's very well. Marvellous. There you go. That's all we need to know about her. Yeah. She hasn't got a speaking role. No. So that's it. And there's a bed over here. I think, What do you, have you rested this this year? No, I had some onions in there as well. Onions in there too. So there yeah. you go. So yeah, that's it. But it's resting now. Right, I'm just going to turn around because the sun's in the wrong place. Okay. So there you go. There's a little sun, trip. Oh, it's always there. It, yeah, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Yeah. So that's it. Mr. Sam, the allotment man. We are still alive. We, yeah, do, we don't just, do it just just we don't do it all the time because we we made i think it's about 100 odd videos are we yeah, something like that seems and like it's like there, we run out of things to talk about but we thought we'd just as i was over um have a look and see what's going on so there yeah, you go it comes to see if we're still alive yeah and haven't changed our wheels or the locks or the locks yeah okay so there you are so uh from <laughs> me mr sam the allotment man and dad we'll see you probably in another six months time and uh Happy growing. Yes. Bye.